Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a love reading for the zodiac sign of Aquarius. So if you have Aquarius anywhere in your birth chart, this video may resonate with you. So don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. If you want to book a personal reading with me, just email me. My email is in the description box down below. So let's see what's going on. I'm going to be doing this reading at like 3 something, almost 4 something in the morning. I just woke up. I just felt like I need to do a reading. So, here I am. Here I am, here I am. Okay. Let's see what's going on. Oh, Chris. Spirit guys of the night and test the masters. My angel of the highlight. Oop. Okay. So let's see what's going on. The knight of swords. So, it could be connected to a Gemini Taurus. Seven of Cups, Scorpio, and we have here the King of Pentacles. Oh shit! So these are the cards. I'll be trying to show y'all the cards, but then sometimes I don't. I just got them right here, but this is the cards. Okay, so. I'm seeing here that somebody here is trying to search for their next victim. And I'm seeing here somebody here could have found somebody that they can manipulate that's gullible. Okay, that's naive. To be with. Because I'm seeing here, somebody here sees that you're in a new connection with somebody here that could, you know, be on their shit. They look good. Okay, they got their shit together. And this person, they probably is a bum, you know. They don't got their shit together, you know. And somebody here that you with could be like flesh. You just tell like somebody here to take care of themselves. And somebody here is jealous, which is your ex. Or it could have just been somebody here that you was dealing with, you know. And... If you see the person that your ex got with now, it's like this person look like they don't take care of themselves. Like somebody here just look raggedy as fuck. Okay. It look like they stink. <laughs> like they pH balance is off or something. Okay. And I feel like somebody here that this person got with, they could have thought that this person was nice. They was genuine, you know. Like, they really care and love them and wanted them. Like, I'm sitting here, like, it's an ex of yours that could have told somebody, you're like, I want to treat you good, you know? And they actually treat this person like shit. They're actually still cheating on this person. And I feel like this person tried to leave them, and they're, like, somebody here is being blackmailed. Like, somebody here is telling them, like, if you leave, I'm going to expose you, blah, 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 blah. This is what your ex is telling this person that they're with. And they could also be with this person just because of their finances here. And I feel like it's your ex here that thinks like you're with somebody here because of their finances here. But that's not the case. <laughs> you just got with somebody here that's, you know, you don't have to take care of. Because I feel like you probably could have took care of this person and always, you know, overgave. And this person just breadcrumbed you and shit. Or they never got their shit together. It's like anytime this person was trying to get money or get a job, it's like they can't keep a job. Or it's like somebody here just don't know how to manage their money. They're spending money on necessary shit. And you were just tired of that. You feel me? You know what else? Somebody here could have a drug addiction. We have four pentacles. Yeah, somebody here is not letting you go. They're holding on to you tightly here. And I feel like this new person that you're with, they're holding on to you too. This person genuinely love you. They care about you. Okay. This person love language could be like buying you things, okay? And I feel like you could be either showing it off like on social media, like they're watching this ex of yours and they could be seeing like, wow, like they're getting this, they're getting that, you know? And it's not like you're trying to brag or anything like that. You know, you just, you, you should be able to show off what your partner's doing for you or anything like that, you know? I just like somebody here think you're trying to throw something in their face and that's not the case.
five of cups yeah somebody here is watching you be in love properly okay that's it period and they're sad five of cups here somebody here could be acting like they're happy in a connection but the whole time they're depressed as fuck okay they're thinking about you all the time this person has a lot of emotional baggage to a sword just like this person they just go towards anybody here just to feel some type of love or to use their their healing energy or these bitches that this person go to probably don't even have healing energy <laughs> they just dumb and do whatever somebody here i'm getting as long as you fuck me good we good like these are the type of bitches that this person intertwine with We have the two of swords here. Yeah, I'm seeing here that somebody didn't want to make a decision here. You know, they want to fuck off and do what they want to do. Somebody here was playing with you, you know, trying to manipulate you, play my games and shit. You know, yeah, the moon card high shit from you. And that shit eventually came to the light with the star card here. Okay. And I feel like somebody here was insecure as fuck. Like, it's like somebody here didn't want to see you shine you know somebody here tried to really bring down your your self-esteem you know just make you feel real disgusted with yourself what else and i feel like they could have been messing with this person that they was with now while they was dealing with you still and it's like they they had this person like for backup and that's and when you left this person, that's who they went to. What else? The devil, yeah. Somebody here has a sex addiction. Somebody here likes to have control. When this person feels like they don't have control, they literally like have a, like a temper tantrum here. I'm seeing somebody here just yelling and shouting. And you're just. You know, somebody here could be, like, going to rob people or kill people or some shit like that. Like, somebody here really, like, is crazy in the head. This is how they let off their, like, their anger or some shit. Somebody here likes the adrenaline rush of going to fuck off. I mean, fuck over people. If you get what I'm trying to say. Like, making other people feel how they feel, basically. What else? Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody here is holding on to some shit that happened in their childhood or something like that. Okay. And somebody here needs to heal it and let that shit go. Because it's, it's really like fucking their life up for real, for real. If you ask me. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like you're independent. You got your own shit going on here. Okay, you didn't try to seek out revenge on this person or nothing like that. You know, it's like you really want this person to just leave you the fuck alone. And there's somebody here that this person could be dealing with that think that you obsessed with them or you still want them or some shit like that. And then you don't get no fuck. Like... <laughs> A chariot. I feel like people don't understand the level of you don't give no fuck. There is. <laughs> like for real, for real. Yeah, it's like you was determined to move forward from this shit. You was like, it's just too much. You feel me? It's too fucking much. It's like this person just comes into people's lives and just fuck it up. Okay, and I feel like you was able to save and start focusing on, you know, your goals and, you know, a dream of yours has came true here, you know, because this person was a distraction. I feel like this person wanted to be with you 24-7, you know, if they want to know what you was doing, this person could have always went through your phone. 
just looking for some shit. And it wasn't even nothing there. They just wanted to start an argument or something. Like, this person needs, like, some type of argument. Like, shit just can't be cool, calm, and collective. You know, it just can't be positive vibes. Somebody here just loves to argue. Yeah, you got your own shit going on. You don't need this person. This person see that you don't need them. It's more of them being codependent on you. You're not codependent on this person at all. And somebody here is seeing like you're happy. You know, you're enjoying your life. You could be traveling. Okay, I feel like you could dress very nice here. You just look like, you know, you're doing good, you know? And I feel like you're not, this not a facade that you're putting on. Like you're actually doing good. You feel me? Because this is how a person they have put on a facade. Like they're just living the, their best life. They're so happy. And they're not. You have the moon. Yeah, somebody here thought that you was going to just come back to them. They was like, oh, this is just what so-and-so do. Aquarius do. Like, they're going to come back. You know? And somebody here is saying, like, damn, like, they're not coming back. Like, we have a king of swords. What else? And we have here the sun. I'm seeing this person could have tried to blackmail you. They could have, like, texted you or hit you up or some shit like that and told you, like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to expose you and shit like that. If you, um... Leave me. But you still left. It was like, fuck that. Expose me. Do what you got to motherfucking do. But I won't be spending another day with your ass. Okay. <laughs> I don't give two fucks. That kind of moon. The four of wands. What else? The moon. The two of wands. Which is the six of wands. Somebody here. It's trying to protect their reputation. Like somebody here cares what everybody think. Somebody here knows some type of secret here. But they're trying to like cover it up. Like somebody here could got like an STD or some shit like that. And they could be lying saying that they don't have it. But when they went to the doctor, they had the shit. Mm. Or somebody here could be. I feel like this is what this who this person is with. They could have cheated on this person, but this person don't know that they cheated on them with somebody else. Like somebody here could be acting like they love this person and you know they care about them the whole time. They're looking for something out of this situation with this person, but they're saying this person don't have shit. <laughs> they don't have shit but dick or pussy to offer. Yeah. Like, this ex of yours, they're being strategic with the person that they're with. They're not with them because they love them. Yeah. So, I see here. Somebody like, shit. Like, damn. What the fuck did I get myself into? Clarify the sun. Seven of wands. Yeah, this person is trying to think of a plan here. So I have the sun. So I have the king of swords. And I feel like this ex of yours, they have a good intuition as well. 
Like this person, they could feel like you're hiding something from them. Go for the King of Swords. Ten of Wands. Yeah. Clarify the King of Swords. I knew I was getting karmic energy. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody here wanted you to be a part of a, a, a third party situation or a poly or some shit like that or up a relationship with them. Because they see it as being able to have more money. You know? Somebody here is not getting into a poly relationship because of the right reason. Somebody here just want to get into it because of the sex. It the fact that you know if it's more people it's more money mm-hmm hell no somebody here could be moving to like house to house or somebody here could live in their car or some shit like that and I feel like whoever that they're with, they could be struggling. And somebody, this person is seeing like, damn, like this person is struggling. They ain't really got shit. Okay, they could probably have a a, a kid or some shit that they got to take care of. Somebody here is draining this bitch. And that's what this hoe get. Because I feel like this person knew about you, but they waited their turn or some shit like that. Or they was fucking around with this person on, on a, you know, playing their role. Waiting to something happen with y'all so that this person come towards them. Now they see, like, damn, like, yeah. You see what the hype about? It ain't no hype, bitch. We have the seven of wands here and the real card. Yeah. I feel like you're happy because you're protecting your energy from this person, okay? You're done with their ass. You don't want nothing to do with them. You don't want to have a conversation or nothing. Nothing. You're experiencing joy. You can be celebrating. I feel like you're at peace. And this person up there with could have tried to argue with you or some shit like that. Yeah. All smiles. Somebody here really thought that they was going to, like, fuck with you or some shit like that. Like, you're not bothered at all. Not one bit. You see how this person look in this card? They're angry. They look upset. And look how you look. They're smiling. Queen of Wands. Looking good as fuck. Okay, this person knows people is trying to throw themselves at you. They know it. <laughs> And I feel like it, their, blood, their blood is bull and just seeing you happy. Somebody here don't want to see you happy here. They want to see you stressed out with their ass. We have the Six of Swords, Two of Cups, and Reverse. Yeah. You released their ass. And for some of y'all could have moved, changed your number. Okay. Like, really blocked this person on social media or some shit like that. Like, you don't want this person to know nothing. Like, you could have made your page... Um, private me i don't be giving a fuck my page is public okay i'm not hiding shit <laughs> you gonna see what you gonna see okay i'm not making nothing private it is what it is okay so a custom verse yeah somebody here could be um going through a breakup because i took custom verse but I feel like you're about to meet a new person because the two of cups in reverse to me, that's like the ace of cups. So I'm seeing here you're about to meet somebody new. But it's like somebody here could have broke up with the person that they was with because they see like, oh wait, you're getting away too far. Like somebody here doesn't feel your energy anymore. Like, you know, I don't know why my throat just sounded like that. Somebody here don't want me to say that. Yeah, somebody here is trying to hide the fact that <laughs> they want to get next to you. Okay, somebody here could have followed you to where you would stand, like somebody here could like live down the street from you or some shit, and you don't even know it, or live in the same state as you that you moved to, and you don't even fucking know it. Grab out two of cups in reverse. Yeah, see, somebody here is coming back to you. They're they're breaking up with somebody here because they miss you. They're nostalgic. Okay. Yep. What else with the two of cups in reverse? Damn, I'm at 19 minutes already. They're probably two of cups in reverse. Yep. They want you to have their kid. Somebody here wants to stay attached to you. So they're like, I need to get this person pregnant. Okay, I need to. <laughs> or somebody else is going to get this person pregnant. Because you got that, that good, good, okay? You got that shit that makes somebody go crazy. Because you see what they're doing. Okay? <laughs> Period. But 
I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. If it did, don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!